Hello everyone, in this video, I am going to explain, types of IC packages, to watch, more videos, please subscribe to my channel, open box, education, if you like this video, please share to your, friends. The ceramic ball grid array, or CBGA, is a square shaped, or, rectangular ceramic package, that uses solder balls, for external electrical connection, instead of leads. These solder balls are arranged in a grid, or array at the bottom of the, ceramic package body, hence the name ceramic ball grid array. Actually, the CBGA is just one of several types of the BGA package. The ceramic column grid array, or CCGA, is a square shaped, or, rectangular ceramic package, that uses solder columns, for external electrical connection, instead of leads, or solder balls. These solder columns, are arranged in a grid, or, array at the bottom of the ceramic package body, hence the name ceramic column grid array. The CCGA is basically, just a CBGA package, that has solder columns, instead of solder balls. The ceramic dual inline package, or, SER dip is one of the most mature, IC packages still in use today. It is a rectangular ceramic package, that has leads extending, from both of its longer sides, thus forming, two sets of inline pins. The ceramic package, or SER pack, is a hermetically sealed, rectangular ceramic package, that has leads extending, from both of its longer sides, thus forming, two sets of inline pins. It is therefore a type of, dual inline package like the SER DIP. The ceramic leadless, chip carrier, or CLCC or LCC, is a square or rectangular, surface mount ceramic package, that has no leads. For electrical connection, to the outside world, the LCC instead uses flat metal contacts, known as pads, around the four sides, of the package bottom. The ceramic pin grid array, or CPGA, is a square, or, rectangular through hole, ceramic package, whose pins, or, leads are arranged in a square array, at the bottom of the package body. The CPGA can either, have a Fritz sealed, ceramic lid, or, a solder sealed metal lid. The ceramic quad flat pack, or CQFP, is a ceramic IC package, with leads extending from, all four sides of the package body. CQFPs are predominantly, square in shape, although rectangular variants do exist. The CQFP is just, one of the many types of the, quad flat pack package. The dual flat no leads package, or, DFN, is a very small square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount, plastic package with no leads. Metal pads, or, lands along two sides, of the bottom of the DFN package, serve as electrical connection points, to the outside world. The DFN is similar to the QFN, except that the latter, has lands all around the, periphery of the package instead of, just two sides like the DFN. The fine pitch ball grid array, or, FGA or FBGA, is a smaller version of the, ball grid array, BGA, package. As in all BGA packages, FBGAs use solder balls, that are arranged in a grid, or, array at the bottom of the package body, for external electrical connection. However, the FBGA is, near chip scale in size, with a smaller, and thinner body than the standard BGA package. As its name implies, it also features, a finer ball pitch. The low profile fine pitch ball grid array, or, LFP BGA, is a smaller version of the ball grid array package. It is basically, an FBGA package that has, a package height ranging from 1.2 mm and 1.7 mm. It is therefore, thicker than the, TFGA and the VFBGA. The land grid array, or LGA, is a package that uses, metal pads for external electrical connection, instead of leads, or solder balls. These metal pads, which are called lands, are arranged in a grid, or, array at the bottom of the package body, hence the name land grid array. The grid arrangement, of the lands of the LGA package allows, 
it to have a high land count, making it a popular packaging option for devices with high input output requirements. The low profile quad flat pack, or LQFP, is a surface mount IC package with leads extending from all four sides of the package body. The micro lead frame package, or MLP, is a JEDEC compliant, very thin, near CSP square shaped, or rectangular surface mount plastic package uses metal pads instead of leads for electrical connection to the outside world. The MLP belongs to the same no leads package family as the QFN and the DFN. The metric quad flat pack, or MQFP, is a surface mount IC package with gull wing leads on all four sides of the package body. The micro small outline package, or Microsop or MSOP is a very small rectangular plastic package with gull wing leads protruding out of its longer sides. The MSOP is a miniaturized version of the SSOP package, having a smaller footprint than the latter. The J leaded ceramic chip carrier or JLCC is a square or rectangular surface mount ceramic package that has J formed leads around its periphery. The plastic, molded equivalent of the JLCC is the PLCC. The plastic ball grid array, or PBGA, is a square-shaped plastic molded package that uses solder balls for external electrical connection instead of leads. These solder balls are arranged in a grid, or array at the bottom of the plastic package body hence the name plastic ball grid array. Actually, the PBGA is just one of several types of the BGA package. The plastic dual inline package, or PDIP, is one of the most mature plastic IC packages, still in use today. It is rectangular in shape, and has leads extending from both sides along its length, thus forming two sets of inline pins. The plastic leaded chip carrier, or PLCC is a four-sided plastic package that has J leads around its periphery. These J leads occupy less board space than the gull wing leads that other packages like the SOIC have. PLCC lead counts range from 18 to 84. PLCC packages can either be square or rectangular in shape. The ceramic equivalent of the PLCC is the JLCC. The plastic pin grid array, or PPGA, is a square-shaped plastic package, whose pins, or leads are arranged in a square array, at the bottom of the package body. The PPGA, is just one of several types of, the PGA package. Because of the array arrangement, of the leads in a PGA package, it can provide much higher lead counts, than other packages. This is the reason why, the PGA is a popular choice for devices with high input output counts such as microprocessors. The Power Quad Flat No Leads Package, or PQFN, is a small square shaped or rectangular surface mount plastic package with no leads that is capable of high power dissipation. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads around the periphery of the bottom of the package body for electrical connection. To the outside world. It is basically a high power version of the quad flat, no leads package. The plastic quad flat pack, or PQFP, is an IC package with leads extending from all four sides of the package body. PQFPs are predominantly square in shape, although rectangular variants do exist. The PQFP is just one of the many types of the quad flat pack package. The Power Small Outline Package, or PSOP, is a rectangular small outline IC package, developed by Amker, that integrates a copper heat slug in its plastic body. The die is attached to this heat slug, increasing the chip's ability to dissipate heat and thus handle more power. The PSOP achieves 40% Theta JA improvement over that of standard SOICs. The Quad Flat No Leads Package, or QFN, is a very small square-shaped, or 
rectangular surface mount plastic package, with no leads. It is basically a quad flat package, except for the absence of leads, protruding from its sides. Metal pads, or, lands around the periphery, of the bottom of the QFN package, serve as electrical connection points, to the outside world. Because the QFN has no leads, and, has shorter bond wire lengths, it exhibits less inductance, than leaded packages, and, therefore provides a higher electrical performance. The QFN package, also includes an exposed thermal pad, at the package bottom, to facilitate heat dissipation from the die. The quarter size outline package, or, QSOP, is a small rectangular surface, mount plastic package, with gull wing leads, protruding out of its longer sides. The side braze package, is one of the most mature IC packages, still in use today. It is a rectangular ceramic package, that has leads extending from both of its longer sides, thus forming two sets of inline pins. It is therefore a type of dual inline package. Two other widely used DIPS are the PDIP and the SAIR DIP. Small outline transistor packages are very small, inexpensive surface mount, plastic molded packages with leads, on their two long sides. Due to their low cost, and low profile, SOTS are widely used in consumer electronics. The SOT23 and the SC70 packages are, two of the most widely used, SOT packages today. Note that, aside from these two, there are many other SOT package types, used in the IC industry. The single inline package, or, SIP, is an IC package, that has a single row of leads, protruding from the bottom of its body. It is not as widely used, as dual inline packages, such as the PDIP, and the SAIR DIP, because of its, limited number of pins. SIPS are often used, in packaging networks, of multiple resistors. The Small Outline Integrated Circuit, or, SOIC, is a small rectangular surface mount, plastic molded integrated circuit, package with gull wing leads. The leads protrude, from the longer edge of the package. It is one of the most, commonly used surface mount packages, today. The Small Outline J-Lead Package, or, SOJ, is a small rectangular surface mount, plastic molded integrated circuit, package with J-formed leads. The leads protrude, from the longer, edge of the package. The SOJ is also sometimes referred, to as SOIJ, or J-leaded small outline, IC package. The shrink plastic dual inline package, or, SPDIP, is a rectangular plastic package, with leads extending, from both of its long sides, thus forming, two sets of inline pins. The SPDIP, is actually just a shrink version of the PDIP. As such, the SPDIP provides, a smaller package size, compared to a standard PDIP for the same lead count. The Thin Dual Flat No Leads Package, or, TDFN, is a very small end, thin square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount plastic package with, no leads. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads, along two sides of the package body, for electrical connection to the outside world. It is basically, a thinner version, of the dual flat no leads package. The thin profile fine pitch ball grid array, or, TFBGA, is a thinner version of the FBGA package. Like all BGA packages, TFBGAs use solder balls, that are arranged in a grid, or, array at the bottom of the package body, for external electrical connection. The TFBGA is near chip scale, in size and, features ball pitch values, that are even tighter, than those of the FBGA. The thin quad flat no leads package, or TQFN, is a very small and thin square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount plastic package, with no leads. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads, around the periphery of the bottom, of the package body, for electrical connection, to the outside world. It is basically, a thinner version of the, quad flat no leads package. 
The Thin Quad Flat Pack, or TQFP, is a surface mount IC package, with gull wing leads, on all four sides of the package body. It is basically, a thinner version of the, MQFP and LQFP. The Thin Small Outline Package, or TSOP, is a rectangular IC package, with a thickness of 1 mm. There are two types of TSOPS. The Type 1 TSOP has its leads, protruding from the shorter edges, of the package. The Type 2 TSOP has its leads, protruding from the longer edges, of the package. The Thin Shrink Small Outline Package, or TSSOP, is a rectangular surface mount plastic package, with gull wing leads. It has a smaller body, and, smaller lead pitch, than the standard SOIC package. It is also smaller, and, thinner than a, TSOP with the same lead count. The Ultra Thin Dual Flat No Leads Package, or, UTDFN, is a very small, and, thin square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount plastic package, with no leads. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads, along two sides of the package body, for electrical connection, to the outside world. It is basically a, thinner version of the, thin dual flat no leads package. The ultra thin quad flat no leads package, or, UTQFN, is a very small, and, thin square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount plastic package, with no leads. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads around, the periphery of the package body, for electrical connection, to the outside world. It is basically, a thinner version of, the thin quad flat, no leads package. The very thin profile fine pitch ball grid array, or, VFBGA, is a thinner version, of the TFBGA package. Like all BGA packages, VFBGAs use solder balls, that are arranged in a grid, or, array at the bottom of the package body, for external electrical connection. The VFBGA is near chip scale, in size, and, features ball pitch values, that are even tighter than, those of the TFBGA. The very small outline package, or, VSOP, is one of several smaller versions of the SOIC package, having a compressed body, and, a tightened pitch, for its gull wing leads. Another smaller version of the SOIC is, the SSOP. The extremely thin dual flat no leads package, or, XDFN, is a very small and thin square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount plastic package, with no leads. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads, along two sides, of the package body, for electrical connection, to the outside world. It is basically, a thinner version of, the ultra thin dual flat, no leads package. The extremely thin quad flat no leads package, or, XQFN, is a very small and extremely, thin square shaped, or, rectangular surface mount plastic package, with no leads. Instead of leads, it uses metal pads, around the periphery of the package body, for electrical connection, to the outside world. It is basically, a thinner version of, the ultra thin quad flat, no leads package. The double decawatt package, or D2 pack or DDPAK is the successor to the DPAK package, which was designed by Motorola to encase discrete high power devices. The D2PAK is bigger than the DPAK, and comes in several versions with different terminal counts. The D2PAK, which has a flat heatsink at the back, is basically the surface mount equivalent, of the TO220, through hole package, and is therefore sometimes referred to as SMD220. The D2PAK is also known as TO263. The Decawatt package, or DPAK, is an IC package developed by Motorola to encase discrete high power devices. The DPAK is also known as the TO252. The acronym DPAK can also stand for the term discrete package. Thank you very much for watching this video. To watch more videos, please subscribe to my channel, Open Box Education. Thank you.